Hello everybody, the Fluffy Mane here. And in today's video, I want to open up this Poltergeist fee box with a Poltergeist fee promo and a jumbo card. And it contains four booster packs. I'm sorry for the glare because I need some lighting if I want to make some videos. And we have a look see on the back. And you can see it there, one foil card, one oversized card, four booster packs and a coat. So let us open up this pack and just see what is inside. I'm trying to open up this box. Okay, so multitasking is a little bit hard to talk <laughs> and speak together when opening the box. There we have it. We have a lot of plastic again. And we have this beautiful Poltergeist promo card. What number is it already? Sword and Shield number 21. I want to place it in this purple sleeve. Place it right there. Then we have this beautiful jumbo card. And I'm just wondering how you guys are protecting it or where you place it. Because at the moment I just stack them and just place them in a map. But you want to also place it somewhere safe, just like your promo cards, that you can place it in a smaller map. I'm not sure if um, somewhere else in the world they have like little smaller maps where they fit in. But I couldn't find them at the moment. There we have a code card. And then we have our four booster packs with two Rebel Clash, Sword and Shield, and Steam Siege. So I'm just wondering, I hear a lot of people saying that they don't like Steam Siege, but I'm wondering why, because I do like Steam Siege. So let me just start off with Steam Siege, end up with the boat Rebel Clash, and it has a Guard of War on it. So hopefully we can pull something nice today in this video. Going to cut it out again with the scissors. Be careful though. As always, I'll do three from the back because if the energy is matching the rare card, I will give the code cards away. Or either if I have a hollow or better in the sets where a hollow isn't common. Because in the newer sets with champion's pad, hollows are common. So, and in this set, it's not because champion's pad is a special set. So that's why they mostly have hollows. So let us open up the packs and see what we have. So we start off with a Duod, Steelix Spirit Link, a Shield On, Litleo, Nose Pass, Seedod, Clauncher, Bergmite. Our reverse is a Skip Loom, and it's so happy. And we have a regular rare Jan Mega. So let us open a Sword Shield. And I'm just wondering if you guys liked all the videos that I've made. And if you have any tips, just please let me know. Place it below the comments. Tree from the back. And we start off with a Twacky. Aurora Energy, Pocket Gear 3.0 or 3.0, Rookedy, Sizzlepeed, Snom, Mawile, Gossifleur, Reverse is a Musharna, and ooh, a Hollow Cinder Race with a Electric Energy or Lightning Energy. There we go, we have a code card. And then I place this up in my sleeve. Oh, at least we get a hollow. And we still have two packs to go. So let's open up Rebel Clash. So I'm still getting used of how to open up the packs, place the setup, try to use a little bit more light. So that's why you might see a little bit of glare. Otherwise it is too dark and I'm not really sure how to lighten up everything. I haven't cut it up open well. Three from the back. 
We start off with a Metapod, charge a bug, burning scarf, coughing, shinx, galarian yamask, an applin, hatena, a reverse common lotad, and a spiritum prayer with a grass energy or leaf energy. Leave is sure, is it grass or is it leaf? So unfortunately that didn't brought us anything. So hopefully the last pack will give us a little bit of luck. At least we already have a hollow. So that's at least something. So okay, let's open up the last pack. Three from the back. And then we have a scoop up net, Heracross. Electrode, Coughing, Bronzor, Toxel, Litwick, Lotad, we got a Reverse Milo, and ooh, ooh, we ending up with something special. It's a Sanaconda fee. I don't think that I have a Sanaconda fee, so that's good. And a Psychic Energy with a code card. So we place this up in a sleeve again, and then we're going to check what we have. We have this beautiful Cinderace holo. You see that it's hollow because it, it, the card itself is regular, but you see that in the inside it has like a holo effect. That's why it's holo. And this is a special rare card because you can also see that it has a um, silver star and that you have like a big picture of the Pokemon instead of this smaller size with a lot of information. So I really like this pool. So hopefully you guys like this video and hopefully I see you all in my next video. Thank you so much for watching.